an It's a lovely prize. Maybe this is the way I should express my no. Huh. <laughs> There's nothing more fun than scouring the racks for the perfect piece. What about your husband? Isn't he waiting for you? If he wants me, he'll find me. Hey there. Are you looking for anything in particular today? Until I see the price tag inside. Warm, relaxation, the sweet embrace of pretty ladies. Oh, that's what I need. I came to watch a few matches. Tell me, child. If I do something, I can Hey there, friend. Grab a seat. Any seat that's open. You got another order barbecue and a glass of Lucille. Sure about that? You still got room? Um... I'm in the mood for dinner. Please come back later. As if you're not here to call the honey boys. The audience is part oh, of the court. To enter or not to enter. That is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? <laughs> I knew it. Let me guess. After you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self-loathing. But it only lasts a moment, doesn't it? Next thing you know, you're right back here again. Huh? Got a question for me? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her! <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny! Your Tifa needs you! Tifa, I'm coming, baby! Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. Are they falling out of the tank or some shit? Ah, so they're both collectors. That feud's got to run deep. All the hell and back? We're safe for now. They've agreed to a ceasefire, apparently. Damn. I sure hope that lasts. Yeah. But there's bad blood between them. 
Heard they had a falling out over a tank or some shit. Ah, so they're both collectors. That feud's got to run deep. close to turning all that ordinance loose. Now blow us all the hell and back? We're safe for now. They've agreed to a ceasefire, apparently. Damn. Sure hope that lasts. So Do come again. Collectors. That feud's got to run. Welcome, come on in, take a look, take a look. Now blow us all the hell and back. We're safe for now. They've agreed to a ceasefire, apparently. Damn, I sure hope that lasts. Thank you. I hope to see you again soon. Huh. That old dude in the vacant lot next to the inn? I'd the kill to get my hands yeah. on Shinra's realm. There's makeup. bad blood between them. <laughs> well, now that thing. Check it out. Uh... I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. 
Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud? Requesting permission? Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the <laughs> way it is, hmm? Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty, please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then, how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Guess right, and I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. Tails. Heads, you lose. Hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio and not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Coin. I had a hunch. That's 
cheating. And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Welcome to the world of tomorrow. This energy pulsing from my fingertips. I guess they're closed right now. I feel rejuvenated, alive. It's like I've got a brand new body. Oh. God <sighs> Maybe I ought to give up. But... I feel guilty. Here Man. we go again. What's <laughs> supposed to go place? down like this? Think so. Uh, I just wanted to see Let me handle Andreas. this. Curse you wait out here, will. okay? But then why would I do like... that? Oh. No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that. You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Good evening. Oh. Uh, hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honeybee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honeybee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh. We don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes, well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare. But Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Hey, I wonder if my honey Are you nervous too? You bet I am! I am. I hope you enjoyed the show. I know why you're here. To gawk at the you know, Gotta stay sharp, though. Lifetime bands are lifetime bands. Oh, honey. We're not. I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become I the best. I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. I love that. That's so much better. Clean enough to this is going to be a This is it. Huh? This place is absolute chaos, but it's amazing. You don't have anything like it up in the plate. <laughs> Drank a little too much. Maybe the breeze will sober you up. Oh, kid. I know you're not telling me to move. I'll let it slide tonight. Aren't you a curious cat? You've got balls, so I'll give you a pass. This once. Wait. You don't mean... You didn't see or hear anything. Oh, kid. I know you're not telling me to move. 
Wait, you don't mean the newbie too, right? I said deal with it. Can't have this coming back on you. <laughs> Ooh, oh, duh. Uh. Oh, <gasps> hey, bro! Ain't nobody gonna give a shit if you get your throat cut here. Yeah, uh, and it all leads uh, back to Shinra. They're the ones moving the money. Hey, the you scenes. think that guy's doing no, okay? But this street. The one that everyone says is bad news. Shit, you're right. There's something downright wrong with this. Yeah. The best thing that's ever been done to me. Shit. My sweet, sweet. <laughs> Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm-hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> And what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, love of... Uh, say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Mm. Uh. Uh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... <laughs> hmm... Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! <sighs> the strong, firm hands of a fighter. Yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. <sighs> okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? If you're not a customer, then get out. Oh, thank God we call it a night. Feds calling my name. I feel rejuvenated.
Gramps has been feeling a lot better ever since he heard about what happened. Nothing but the best here. No materia, no life. I can't skip work. Not even. Uh, had it out with the wife the other Folks got nothing but good the things to say about you. So, do you think this means I'm still not comfortable here after the sun. I wonder if things will be up and running. I spend every last day. We make sure to patrol the extra bit I'd borrow. Hey, you're a so soldier, right? Hey, Merc, if you're heading to set your seven, you're going the wrong way. Hey there. I wonder if Avalanche knows We're patrolling we get the occasional monster here. On the other hand, the trains might not start up. Think you've been helping out? I wonder if things will be up and running. Yeah, this place takes getting used to. Night out in the slums. How exactly do you know? Oh.
Ready to take the plunge, are we? So, which course will it be? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well to do patrons. First, the hand cream. A generous coating for each and every one of your richly deserving fingers. Let's start with the tips. That's it. Relax. I'm only here to help. Oh, did that hurt? No. <laughs> Then I'll move on to the base of the fingers. Let's see if we can't improve your circulation and get that blood flowing. <laughs> no, don't fight it. Stress is poison to the body. And finally, some gentle stimulation for the palm. No more than a touch. Just like this. Oh, what was that? A cry of pleasure? Is this how you like it? How about this? Or maybe this? <laughs> if that was to your liking, do come again. Right. How was it? Huh? You okay? Yeah. You're acting weird, Cloud. I am? Really weird. Hmm. Think you'll make a habit of it? Then, I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm? Okay. Really? But, you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It matter what I think? Well, I think it's pretty cool. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So... What should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good, because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. There any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So, 
What do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? The doors are now open! Please form a line in an orderly... No pushing! Think you'll see any soldiers tonight? What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? Team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. <sighs> Alright, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. So, how deep does this thing go, you think? I wonder how many people are fighting. Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus. Like you should. You two, wait here until it's time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you again. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know. So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well, I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. 
I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next match, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talk about a bad date! And this is their first tournament. A bad first date? And most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! <laughs> Dummy bullshit. What's up with the pole? Gonna do a little dance for us, baby girl? <laughs> okay, now I'm mad. Say what happened? What if Walmart gets owned a renowned master of beasts? Will his pets make a meal of our two challengers before our very eyes? They've already been given their appetizers. Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable. The demon dogs of hell. The Sanguine Stalkers! You brought animals? Oh? First timers, huh? There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We're in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this brutal contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink! Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now! Your No escape. Enough. You, you bastard. Bastard. I don't think anyone saw this coming. What a completely unexpected turn of events. And the winners of our match are Cloud and Eren. Well, that's one win down. Go team! Mm. What's wrong? The rules don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. Well, that was some bullshit. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. That's what they call beginner's luck. But the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, 
try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semifinals, fresh from their first date with death, I present the lucky couple. We're like unlucky for the rest of us. Give it up once again for Cloud and Eric. Couple my ass. What the hell you two try to pull? You assholes cost me a fortune. Yeah, yeah. Their opponents, the reavers of the scrapyard, thieves and killers through and through. Two criminal for common criminals, the worst of the worst! Ladies and gentlemen, check their pockets, because they may have already robbed you blind! The most contemptible sons of bitches this side of War Market, Bex Benatez! members of Beck's badasses. Hey, that's cheating. The only rule here is that there are no rules. Yeah! If Corneo says it's okay, then you gotta suck yeah! it up. Yeah! Suck it! Did John hit Brandon with approval? This is ridiculous. The odds are overwhelmingly stacked against this. This could be a real bloodbath. So I implore you, ladies and gentlemen, don't look away, or you may miss the best part. The second match of the Corneo Cup semifinals begins oh, now! Hey. Exactly, but a lot. But somehow the winners of our match are once again Cloud and Aaron. That kid's really something. Well, of course he is. I did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. 
Hmm. So is half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call it. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. When I fall from grace, maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing! Andy! Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Cloud and Aerith. The final match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Not bad, not bad. Man, you proved me wrong. You guys are pretty good. It's the final match. You good to go? I've got a lot of money riding on you two. Win it for me! Ladies and gentlemen! Our time together is almost over! Tonight's thrilling Corneo Cup, filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go! <laughs> we know! We're just as disappointed as you are! But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end! So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the plane! Yeah! Come on! Once more, the sweethearts who've surprised us with upset after spectacular upset. The power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed. The champions of Madame M, Cloud, and Eric! Executioners, Chocobo Sam's champions, Cutting and Sweeping! Come on! Robots? More like Shinra armor. More like cheating! <laughs> Who will walk away with the one million kill prize? Get ready for a fight guaranteed to go down in history! The final match of the Corneo Cup begins now!
Taken this rather well. I was looking forward to a little temper tantrum. When you bet it all on a toss, sometimes you get burned by Lady Luck. Every coin has two sides. You're right, of course, even if they are both the same. <laughs> Later. And now. I believe I have a prize to collect. Sorry. The madam will have to wait. The Don's demanding that we tack on one more match, it seems. What? If they win out, then you get paid in full. Now hold on just a goddamn minute! His call, not mine. <laughs> now that that's over, we can go save Tifa. So we'll head back to Madam M's, get you changed, and then it's off to Corneo's. Right. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. But you still have one fight left. What do you mean? The crowd loved your show a little too much. People were placing hefty bets, much heftier than you can possibly imagine. Corneo's going to milk this for as much as he can. Meaning what? You face and defeat Corneo's fighter of choice, and only then will you be declared winners of the tournament. Hey, that wasn't the deal. Don't you think I know that? Ah! You greedy bastard, scum-sucking piece of shit, festering asshole! Uh... <sighs> but that's the way it is. Corneo's the one who makes the rules around here. But if you win this match, Corneo will have to accept your victory. And the crowd will make sure he does. So this is the last one? <laughs> I sure hope so. Go on now. That prize money is going to pay for your dress. I've been working here a long time, but this has never happened before. Well then, you sure fix my wagon. Do you two have any idea how much those mechs cost me? Watching you guys fight gave me goosebumps. Hope your next match is even better than the last. Ready to kick ass? It's not even about the money anymore, man. 
I just want you guys to win it all! Show them what you got! Tonight's Corneo Cup has been a spectacle like no other. And we share your disappointment, ladies and gentlemen, when we told you that it was coming to an end. But nobody felt it more keenly than one time Corneo, who has decided that a bonus match is in order! Participating in this match will be this evening's leading lights, the dynamic duo that has crushed all competition thus far, Cloud and Aerith! Cloud! Cloud! Over here! Look at them! They're so adorable! You're the man, Cloud! Aerith, I love you! Marry me! Their opponent, buried in the bowels of the Coliseum. An unspeakable whore, long imprisoned, set free tonight for your entertainment! The secret star of Don Corneo's stellar stable! Enter the Hell House! It's just... a house. It's no ordinary house. The manifestation of pure evil versus the most badass couple this side of Midgar! Have you ever seen a fight more incredible, more epic? You have not! No, sir, you have not! They'll be singing songs about tonight for generations to come! Keep your eyes glued to the action, ladies and gentlemen! The Cup's final, final battle begins now! All the battle is joined! Already I can tell you this bonus match will not disappoint! No escape. Who knew the hell out of an appetite match? It's Midgar House of the Future today! Easter Friendly now! That's the tournament! I'm sure the demonic Dama Sal found level one kill punch! But its walls won't buckle so easily. Looks like 
like the hell house. <gasps> the hell house. Hey. Hey. Love the big first guest. What kind of party is it? I don't know, but I'm glad I wasn't invited. Get him. Now. It looks like it's raining <laughs> missiles today, folks. The Hell House has got its murderous eyes on the cross. I'll take care of you. I won't give up. Calling fire. Get him. You're up. Disappointing. No, not yet. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, what is happening? What the? Look out! in for another round of musical tears! Another barrage of chaos coming in hot, folks! Will this turn the fight against them? A 
miraculous escape from our courageous contender! But from the looks of you, they had a pretty wild time in there! Party is putting their love to the test. Are they strong enough to pull through? Oh, with the raging fires of hell, leave nothing but panic and cinder. Not looking good. Second wave.
Dispatch is headed! Action! this grand event. on the 
this house, can our couple go burn?
Let your cheers and cheers echo throughout all of the showing an interest in someone. What will you do? <laughs> Why didn't you tell me you guys were gonna kick so much ass? Can I get your autographs? With these babies, you can send intruders flying. I guarantee this is the only home protection you'll ever need. Only a few left. Get yours while you can. There you are. I've been looking for you two. So, Madam M wanted me to give you a message. She says you guys did pretty damn good, and that you should swing by her shop when you're done here. Got it? I was also hoping you might be interested in a few more matches here at the Coliseum. Big events like the Corneo Cup are pretty sporadic, but there's always action if you want to get a piece. Make way for 
for the champion. This champ could take on a soldier. You were incredible. Great job. Way to teach Corneo. You know. Congratulations. I know that you'll be a great influence on my Johnny. Why, you might even end up having a friendly rivalry. You can spur each other to greater heights. I can see it. You two will become great friends. The best of friends. Ha ha ha. Hey, I'm talking to you. I said they're good. Uh -huh. I think this is where they said to me. You're here. Good. I have everything I need to get started. Just one thing before we do. You're the Cloud, right? Cloud the Merc. I'm told you did a wonderful job helping the people of Sector 5. <laughs> you have a very impressive work ethic. It's like they say, good things come to those who work. What goes around comes around, and in ways that might surprise you. <laughs> I'm gonna put Aerith in the most gorgeous dress you've ever seen. <laughs> It'll be a real jaw-dropper. All right, now that that's out of the way, once you change, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready? All right then, let's get started. Beauty takes a lot of work and preparation. Far more than you'd know. In the meantime, let me see, let me think. There ought to be things you can only do without your friend. Now's your chance to get out and have some fun. <laughs> I can tell you're already beginning to feel at home here. Though being so new to it, I assumed you still wouldn't know how to enjoy yourself properly. <laughs> so I went and had a chat with Sam. He said he'd be happy to help you out. Hey, no one asked you to do that. But there's so much you don't know. This is the perfect opportunity for you to learn the ways of the world and man the hell up. And that's enough of that. Aerith, come with me. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the dress. The dress is part of it, sure. But we'll also need to do something about that plain Jane makeup and hairdo. This is gonna take some work. Ouch. Well, I'll see you later, Cloud. Peek, and I'll poke out your eyes. Madam M said you'd be swinging by. Let me see if I've got this straight. You ditched your lady friend and fellow champion to have a boys' night out in Wall Market? Ugh. Kidding. If I know the madam, and I do, this was all her idea. I can see why. There's no denying you're skilled with a sword. But when it comes to damn near anything else, well, can't help but have my doubts. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But then there's nothing wrong with expanding your horizons, neither. Seeking new experiences. Knowing the ways of this here world will help you to better protect her while you're in it. Reckon I got a few solid gigs for you. What do you say? You game? Huh. <sighs> yeah. Why not? <laughs> That's the spirit. You have yourself a grand time tonight, Mr. Merck. Been waiting for you to show up. 
Thanks for coming. And welcome to our humble training hall. Jules, head trainer. If you've got some time to spare, how about a little bit of fun? Wanna try taking on one of our guys? <laughs> You're not serious, are you? Look at him! He's a scrawny little thing. I could snap him like a twig. Now, now. I wouldn't judge this one by his muscle mass. What do you say, Cloud? If you want to give it a go, just let me know. So, you up for a round? Ha! You're taking me on? You look like a dried up old Terpsichore left out in the sun. Got no idea what you're getting into, little man. All right, enough talk. We'll settle this the tried and true traditional way. A squat off. Now, let's all see what you've got. No way I'm letting you win. You've got this, come on! That's how it's done. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. Not bad at all. You've got this, come on! Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. I knew you could do it. You've got this, come on! Your form's yeah. looking good. Not bad at all. That's yeah. how it's done. Your form's looking good. Yeah. Not bad at all. You've got this. Come I knew you could. Not <laughs> bad at all. Your yeah. form's looking good. You've got this. That's how it's done. I knew you could. Come on. One more rep. <laughs> You've got this. Come on. Yeah. You can do better than that. <laughs> Is that it? Ah, how? How the hell did I lose to this scrawny little kid who looks like he doesn't even consume his daily recommended amount of protein? Ronnie, you know it's all about quality, not mass. You're too quick to judge people by their build. That and your overtrained ego are the main reasons you lost to our bold challenger here. Thanks for helping me teach my boys a valuable lesson. And sorry for dragging you into it. Cloud, we're all one big family here at this gym. And now you're part of it. If you're ever up for training, our doors are always open to you. Let's work together to maintain healthy minds and bodies. Endurance and determination, that's what counts. Fight through the pain, almost done. Oh no, muscle cramp! If you're ever in the mood for another workout, just talk gotta to Jay say, Ronnie. the boys the really like having determination. you around. That's what counts. You here to test your muscular metal against mine? Fight through the pain. Now don't go crying to mommy. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. Not bad at all. You've got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. You've got this. Come on. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. Is that the best you can do? Yeah. Not bad. You should try to get into a rhythm. Yeah. 
Now don't forget to breathe. You've got this. Come on. That's how it's done. Not bad. I'm impressed. You know, Jay's always looking for competition. I am awesome! Endurance and determination. That's what you want to go, do ya? All right then, bring it on! Don't quit on me now. You want a six pack? Then give me ten more. You can back out if you're scared. You've got this. Come uh, on. Oh. The best you can do. Yeah. Not bad at all. Your forms. Are Come on. Uh, I know you've got more to give. Uh, you can do better than that. I knew you could do it. Looking good. Let me see you sweat. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. I you two are doing awesome. Your form's looking good. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. You've got this. yeah. Feel the burn. I knew you could do it. Your form's looking good. Not bad at all. That's how it's done. Not bad. Thank you guys. Your form's looking good. You've got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. You two are doing awesome. You've got this. Come on. Yeah, what I tell ya! <laughs> Come on, is that all you got? Let me see your fire! Those who sweat together get swole together! Bringing everything I've got! Huh? You should try to get into a rhythm. Yeah. Your form's looking good! Come on! One more rep! You've got this, come on! Not bad. Look, you can do better than that. That's how it's done. You should try to get into a rhythm. I knew you could do it! Your forms yeah. Feel the burn! Yeah. Now don't forget to breathe. Uh. Uh. Yeah. That's uh. how it's done. Yeah. Not bad at yeah. all. <sighs> you've got come on! I know you've got more to give! I knew you yeah. could do it! That's how it's done! Your form's looking yeah. good! Uh. Yeah. Yeah, what I tell ya! <laughs> if you ever want a rematch, you're more than welcome to one. True athletes need to be able to perform in cool and hot conditions. Are you ready for this? <laughs> Not bad at yeah. all. You've got this, come on! Ah, oh, shit! That's how it's done. <laughs> Your form's looking good! I knew- Looking good! Let me see you sweat! That's how it's done! Your form's looking good! Not bad at all! You've got this, come on! Your form's looking good! I have faith in you guys! That's how it's done! Not bad at all! Your form's looking good! You've got this, come on! I knew you could do it! You two are doing awesome! Not bad at all! I knew you could do 
it! Your form's looking good. You've got this. Come on. Uh, yeah. Feel the burn. Uh, I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. Uh, I knew you could do it. Come on. I know you've got more to get. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. I knew you could. Looking good. Let me see. That's how it's done. You've yeah. got this. Come on. Your form's looking good. Uh, you've yeah. got this. Come on. I have faith uh, in you guys. Not bad at all. I knew you could. Your yeah. form's looking good. Not bad at all. You two oh, are shit. doing awesome. You've got yeah. this. Come on. That's how it's done. Your yeah. form's looking good. I knew you could do it. No. I was never in doubt. <sighs> You did it! You really beat me! You gotta be in incredible shape! <laughs> it's un- What do you say? May I have this squat? <laughs> you up for some exercise? Okay, let's have some fun! You're better than I yeah. thought. Woo! Yeah. You are. I can't get enough of those beautiful muscles. I believe in you. Oh shit! Yeah. Who'd have thought it'd be this close? Just how much slow and steady? One, two, one, two. You're better than I thought. Poetry in motion. Now, now's your chance. I believe in you. Who'd have thought it'd be this close? Yeah, yeah. rules! Show that sissy how it's done! Whoa. <laughs> You're better than I thought! You are yeah. in the zone! Just how much training <laughs> do you do? Woo! Yeah. Oh man, who's gonna win this <laughs> one? Poetry in motion! To tell. I believe yeah. in you! Who'd have thought huh? it'd be this close? You're <laughs> better than I thought! <laughs> I can yeah. hear your muscles crying out in joy! Poetry in motion! <laughs> Just how much training <laughs> do you do? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> You yeah. are in! You're better than I thought! Yeah. <laughs> you gotta loosen up. You're way too tense. Let's you and me work up a sweat. I hope you're all warmed up. Who'd have thought it'd be this <sighs> close? I believe in you! Whoa. Yeah. Just how much training do you do? <clears throat> I can't get enough of those boots! You can't take the pressure! <clears throat> yeah. You're better than I thought! You are in yeah. the zone! <clears throat> you can do it, you! Yeah. Come on, you can win this! <clears throat> Poetry in motion. I believe in you. Woo! You are. Oh man, who's gonna win this one? How much training do you do? Oh, look at that. You're better than I thought. Who'd have thought? Slow and steady. One, two, one. Yeah. Keep your head in the game. Huh? 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 Poetry and motion. Yeah. I don't know how you can recover from that one. Huh? 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 Come on, you can win this. <laughs> you know where to find me for a rematch. 
I'll never say no to a friendly competition. I won't go easy on you. I believe in you! Yeah. So much training do you do? You are in the zone! Yeah, Jules! Show that sissy how it's done! Whoa. I believe yeah. in you! Poetry in motion! You're better than I thought! Who the yeah. You can do it, Jules! We're rooting for you! You are in the zone! There's how much training do you do? Woo! I believe yeah. Slow and steady! One! Two! One! Two! You're better than I thought! Poetry in motion! There's how much training do you do? You I can't get it! Oh, damn! Who'd have thought it'd be this close? There's how much training do you do? Poetry in motion! You're I can hear your muscles crying out in joy and You are in the zone! I believe in you! Woo! You're better than I thought! Oh man, who's gonna win this one? It's too close to tell! You are in the zone! There's how much training do you do? Poetry in motion! Slow and steady! One! Two! One! Two. I believe in you! Who'd have thought it'd be this close? I can't get enough of those beautiful muscles! Woo! <sighs> huh. That was easy. I had no idea how strong you really were. You truly are something, aren't you? Listen up, everyone! We can be stronger! Be Let's hit those weights! You got it, Jules! Endurance and determination. That's what counts. <laughs> you up for some exercise? That's the spirit! Wow, this is it! <laughs> Welcome. Anything in particular you're looking for? Oh, you must be the Merc I've been hearing about. I need you to help me out with my dad. His drunk ass has been at the bar for hours now. Could you bring him back here? He's probably three sheets in over at Drunkard's. <laughs> Just over there. Wait up, Cloud! Sam caught me up on everything. He said you're gonna go rescue Tifa. And to do that, you're trying to learn all about Wall Market. Bro, I know this town like the back of my hand, so I can answer all of your questions. Now, let's go knock this one out. The bar is this way, Cloud. Drunkards, here we come. Mm, uh, are we even allowed here? to walk through the door? Like yeah, I'm getting a regulars only. It's mostly the same folks every night, so. Whoa, you can't just waltz in there uninvited. Listen, there are rules for this kind of. Hey, wait. Hey, old dude. Huh? Well, I'm not going back. Not ever. My life is ruined. It's over. Kill me now. Come on, there's no need to talk like that, old dude. I'll help you out with whatever you need. Really? Oh, thank you, son. See, I made this bet with the Materia Merchant. A sure thing, but then I lost. And so I had no choice but to steal my heart and surrender my precious inspiration. Your precious insp... who with the what now? Inspiration! <laughs> Without it, there's simply no point in me ever going back to the store. Got it. I mean, I don't got it, but I just need to get your inspiration back, right? Whatever the hell that is. 
Leave it to me, old dude. Uh, hey, aren't you gonna go with your friend? I don't even really know how people use materia. They're just like huge orbs. Hey, wait for me! Uh, so this is it, huh? And what do you two want? Uh, uh, I'm here for the precious inspiration you took from the old dude. Inspiration? Oh, that thing. But I didn't take it. I want it fair and square. It's mine by rights now. That's true. But I tell you what. I'll consider giving it back in exchange for... a favor. Uh, what you need? Something only... real men can deliver. Uh. I need you to go and get me something from the vending machine at the inn. You know what. You know. No, I don't think I... Wait. The sauce. The sauce? Stop saying the sauce. Anyway, good luck. Time has come for me to wield my powers of assessment. I can feel it. Oh, I can feel it. Mm. I'm in for one wild ride. They call I'm gonna see coming. some weird shit tonight. Mm. Yeah. Welcome I saw the new policy in jail. I have the perfect room. Hey, are you really leaving me out here? You need me! You need my knowledge? Welcome. Are you in need of accommodations? It looks like a regular old vending machine, right? But wait! <laughs> you ready for this? All right. This particular model has secret buttons. Where? Well, I can't tell you. It's a secret. You just need to tap into your knowledge and expertise, like grab it and whip it out. And then you'll be able to see everything. I don't need to whip it out. I've done this before. Watch this. Whoa, look at you, bro. Huh? Is this the sauce? I don't know. Come on, bro. You know there are more hidden buttons waiting to be pushed. Oh, so this is the sauce. Nito, it, it's time. The last button. The sauce! Put it away! Put it away before someone sees you! No one can know You're the grand prize winner! Have a special prize! <laughs> Don't scare me like that! Whatever! We got what we came here for! Let's get out of here and head to the Materia guy! Uh, is it me or is everyone looking at me? <laughs> uh, 
So this is what it feels like to be a champ. Bro. <laughs> Let's show him what we brought back from our little hmm? trip. Oh, it's you two. It's time, bro. The sauce. Could it be? Oh, it is. The sauce. The sauce. Whoa. Oh, never thought I'd live to see the day. It's just sauce. No big deal. Don't sell yourself short. This is only given to one who is truly a man among men. <laughs> I know. Damn, bro! That's why you're such an awesome dude! Oh, right. Hate to break it to you, but that thing you were looking for? Not here. It's long, long gone. You shitting me? Nope. Sorry. As I recall, the guy who runs the restaurant should have it. Ugh! Well, I guess we know where we're headed next. Come on, bro. Well, that's that. Time to polish the old orbs. Give them a spit shine so they positively sparkle. Hey, if you're done here, then get going already. Restaurant up next, huh? Uh, getting kinda hungry, actually. Did you smell that? I think it's coming from over there. Nope, stay focused. We have work huh? to do first. on the menu today. Hey, wait. Welcome! Feel free to take any open seats. Sorry, we're not here to eat. The Materia guy gave you something, yeah? We want it. Materia guy? Oh, you here for that? I'm surprised. Didn't take you for the type. Let me ask you something. Either of you know anything about cooking? Nope, never cooked once. That's too bad. For some reason, my food doesn't taste nearly as good as it used to. I was hoping one of you two might be able to help me figure it out. I've narrowed it down to the fridge, the stove, or the power supply. But I'm not sure what's to blame. Man. I seriously have no idea what it could be. This sucks. You know, your fridge might be broken. Maybe it's not keeping the ingredients cold enough. That's so. 
You're an expert on all things ice? Okay then. Let's see if we can't fix this by fiddling with the temperature. Hmm. At a glance, everything looks fine to me. Here, eat up. Man, this looks great. What a shame. Maybe next time. Anyway, thanks for your help. Oh, and here's a voucher with my apologies. Get the poor guy some medicine, will you? Drugs. I need all the drugs right now. Now, out of the way. Out of the goddamn way. Who knows how to make it? Or what's this? I did it. I hit it big. No way. So you think it's Well... Oh, that about you you got there? Should have said something sooner. What is it with today? People are dropping like flies. Besides this dumbass? Ah, loads of them. I got enough outstanding orders to fill a book. I was about to... Uh, I'm gonna hurl. Eh, I can't very well leave him alone now, can I? Hey, you're not doing much. Maybe you can deliver that medicine for me. You're what? Military or something, right? Then you must know a thing or two about dealing with the sick and injured. You're a lifesaver. Literally. So, let me see. What needs... Here. Need you to deliver this to someone. You'll probably find this guy sprawled out on the ground somewhere. But make sure you check his... guess where a sick person end up? I'd say the toilet. Starbucks, maybe ones in the shops nearby? Ain't nobody gonna give a shit if you get your throat cut here. Hey, bro! Ain't nobody gonna give a shit if you get your throat cut here. Sorry, can't help you. Sorry, can't help you. Hmm. <laughs> My, what lovely weather we're having. 
What happened? I'll let it slide tonight. Now beat it. Aren't you a curious cat? You've got balls, so I'll give you a pass. Wait. You don't mean the newbie. Mommy, may I please have some more? Mm. Just a mm. little more. Yeah. They call themselves mm -hmm. bankers, but they're just motion. Hey, hey, you think that that is straight? The one that everyone says is bad news. Sorry, can't help you. That candy that comes with the summoning materia ice cream. You have an example. Corneo has an understanding. Uh, huh? Only a select few even know. <laughs> Maybe this is the way I should express my feelings to him. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new material. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Monster. Maybe I should fine tune the. Now, what did I do with. <sighs> I should help Johnny first. Get your delicious materia pops right here! Everybody. Yes, right here! <laughs> step right up, step right up! Huh? What's that? Not working, you say? Pretty rowdy place, isn't it? Hands with my body. Get rowdy. Let loose. If I had to guess where a sick person'd end up, I'd say the toilet. Start by checking those. Maybe ones in the shops nearby? No preferences we can't accommodate. No, sir. So, where are the shady areas? That's easy. You have yourself a grand time tonight, Mr. Trust me, kid. There's a lot of things you're better off not knowing. We can arrange for some help. I think this is where they said to me. Think you're too good for my buns? Come here! Mm -hmm. 
Poison, I tell you. The six. I've got meds. Let me take a look at you. Thanks, buddy. Oh, you saved my life. Here. No. Oh. I'm grateful for your help, but. Should probably head back. this crazy looking house right and it was all like trying to kill him but then cloud was all like bam bam boom your friend fought a house a house oh hey welcome back bro better already yeah now he won't shut up anyway how did deliveries go i did about as much as i could thanks for the help and great work anyway i promise to be worth your while here, I got something you're definitely gonna like. What is it? Well, it belonged to the owner of the clothing store first. Heard from the cook that you boys been running all over town looking for this. Am I right? Wait, we have? Hold up. What were we doing before all this? Oh, shit! The inspiration! Bingo! You see, all us Walmart and entrepreneurs go way... We get together for a game every night, bet all kinds of stuff. This found its way into the pool and eventually into my possession, and now it's yours, cause hey, why the hell not? It's a VIP card, highly coveted and extremely rare. They're only given to a select few. Not having it is gonna do you much good, but... Holy mother of... no way! Bro, we gotta get to the honey... I, 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 I mean drunkards on the double! Tell the old man I said hi! So that's the old dude's inspiration! I'm in here! Wait a Come on, come on, come on! I gotta know! Shaped like everybody's favorite chunk of And them while they're hot! I can't see anything as much as I can, but they still fall. In the place of reflection, at night, the sun is high. Hey, old dude, we're back! Huh? Who are you? You're no son of mine, I think. Special delivery, just for you. Ho oh, ho! My inspiration! You've returned to me at long last! Yo, is that what I think it is? Oh, you bet it is! And it was hard won! 
I sewed dresses day and night for those ladies until I got what I was after. A Honeybee in VIP card! I knew it! Now make way for the VIP, boys. I don't want to keep my ladies waiting any longer. But first, I should pick up a gift dress. Lead the way, old dude. We are coming. Thanks for bringing him back. Can't imagine what you went through. Here, you earned it. Hey, you're coming, right, bro? Get ready for a real Walmart education. I'm done with this. You, you can do whatever the hell you want. I get it, bro. You're scared. It's only natural for people to fear the unknown. Uh. It's a pity you're not gonna join us, but I swear to you, bro. As an aspiring wall market connoisseur, I'm gonna go in there and get as much inspiration as I can handle for you, bro. For you. Because, Cloud, you are my one true bro. Honeybee in, here I come! Inspiration, here I come! <sighs> Perfect example of how age has absolutely nothing to do with maturity. Couldn't agree more. Should probably go see There's Sam again. So, tell me, what'd you see in our little enclave of sin and debauchery? Bet it was an eye-opening experience. Nothing I haven't seen before. That it for jobs? Not exactly. I got one more favor to ask. You want to get teeth out, right? What's your angle? <laughs> Just get your ass to the Coliseum. You'll see. Champ! You know what to do. Take the elevator and head on down. I can't wait to see you fight. We've been waiting for you, champ! Stands are packed thanks to you. Now get out there and give them a show!
Lovers of bloodshed and mayhem, your favorite champion, Cloud, is back in the ring. Right now, this boy may be hot, hot, hot. But look out, folks, because these dynamite challengers may just blow the champ clean off his throne. I hope you brought shades because you're about to see some fireworks. Fighters, begin! Buzz on. Indeed he did! He proved there's nothing more explosive than the guns he's packing! Nice going, champ. You were in fine form today. Here's your cut. You earned it. Not here for the cash. Tell me about Tifa. Ah, Tifa. She's something of a bombshell herself, huh? Girl keeps in shape. And boy, does it show. Hey. Just making an observation, that's all. Anyway, seems like you're serious about getting the poor girl out of her predicament. I could tell easy enough by the way you fought back there. Cut to the chase. Well? You helping or not? Never said I would. 
Opposite, even. Getting mixed up in other people's business isn't my way. Plus, as you are now, I reckon you could ride to a rescue without anybody's help. And that's the truth. You've changed since you first rolled into this here town. For the better. <laughs> At any rate, I've said all I'm gonna say. Your lady friend ought to be done changing by now, am I right? She ain't no Tifa, but she is a firecracker. Keep her waiting too long and she might just blow up in your face. She's... I don't... Take a deep breath. What about Tifa? I heard Corneo was gonna audition new girls soon. And Tifa's... Tifa's gonna be... I just... I, I don't know what to do. Well, I do. I'll come too! Hey, Cloud! Bro, I can call you bro, right? Nope. Just wanna say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. So, like... How'd you get so strong anyway, bro? This is I said. The way you fight, bro, is like poetry and violence. Bam, bam, whoosh, whoosh, you know? I really wish I could be just like you. Hmm? My problem is that I tend to overthink and overanalyze everything. So, bro. Well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but uh, I have a feeling that I'll just be getting in the way. Go find Aerith at Madame Mims. Tell her to wait for me there when she's done. Think you can handle that? Yes, sir! Again. Got a letter of approval right here. Hmm? You know that's only good for women, right? Yeah, it's for Aerith. Who? Oh, that girl you were with. Sorry to hear that. Well, either way, you're stuck out here, pal. I can't let you in. I wasn't asking for permission. Huh? Wouldn't try it if I were you. Trust me, you don't want to screw with the Don. If you even think about causing any trouble, he'll make sure someone pays for it. And that someone might wind up being the girl you're trying so hard to break out. Or it could wind up being someone you've never even met before. Get it? You're in the Don's world now. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition won't start for a while. If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the girl and the letter. But if I were you, I wouldn't. Go on, get out of here.
It's really... Yeah. Corneo's got certain tastes. This dress is so gaudy and impossible to move in. Uh, uh, yeah. Cloud? Uh, uh, excuse me. Huh. Hey, wait a minute. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. I was worried about you. I'm starting to think this place is more dangerous than we thought. Who knows what they'll ask you to do in this audition? No way in hell I'll let you go in there by yourself. By myself? Oh, don't worry. I wasn't gonna. Come on, you'll see. See what, exactly? According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain fabulous someone and they'd like to meet in person. Huh? Look Come at on, you all dolled up and fast. Well, what do we have Where here? You You're quite the pretty little lady. What I wouldn't give to date a hearty like that. that at all. What? Say that again. She's gotta be so feel like this. the honeybee inns Andrea Rodea and convince him to give you his stamp of approval. You said you didn't want me going alone, right? Well, with Andrea's help, you can join me. It'll be fun. And honestly, I think you'll look pretty cute in a dress. What? It's pretty rare for Andrea to take a personal interest in someone. At least, that's what Madame M said. Trust me, this is gonna work out great. Uh... Come on! Don't you wanna save Tifa? Wait. No can do, Cloud. This is our plan, and you'll learn to love it. So, here's how I think we should approach him. Madam M said Andrea was a man who'd give anyone a fair chance to win him over. So I say we march right up to him, explain the situation, and see where that gets us. Sound good? The audience is part of the performance. We have to help make it a great show. The doors are about to open. Our sweet, sweet night is about to begin. I'm so excited, I can't breathe! You're not gonna see a show as captivating as I am but a bee, fluttering about the garden. How the honey doth bind my wings with its treacle. Oh, poison sting, thy name is beauty. And that is the essence of Andrea Rodea's show. Look! The doors are about to open! Our sweet, sweet night is about to begin! This is gonna be amazing! I can't wait! I'm so excited, I can't breathe! Good evening. Welcome to the entertainment extravaganza that is the Honeybee Inn. We're here to see Andrea Rodea. You must be Mr. Cloud. He's waiting for you. Mr. Cloud? I've been instructed to send you through without delay, sir. Please, make your way to the stage in the back. What stage? The one in the back, sir. 
straight through those doors and down the hall. I've dreamt of this moment. The Honey Bee Inn. Hey there, Dollface. We've been waiting for you. Come on in. Have a seat. No, I'm not here for... Huh? Oh, wait a minute. I think you might have wandered into the wrong room by mistake. Watch the stinger, sweetie. <laughs> what shape am I making? Mm. <gasps> this circle? I'm having trouble seeing straight. Ding, 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 ding! That's a right answer, baby! <laughs> you did it, boy -o. I'm so damn proud of you! man of the hour chosen by Andrea himself our honored guest this is your first time right it's okay do you want to practice your dance moves first why would I want to do that Andrea thought it might be a good idea over here come on now hey hold on Mister, move over, girls. A new dancer's come to town. <laughs> Take it away, honey. <laughs> <laughs> Delicious. Perfection. Work it, honey. Delicious. Perfection. Work 
distracted, honey. Delicious. Perfection. Work it, honey. Delicious. <laughs> You've got real rhythm, mister. Move over, girls. A new dancer's come to town. Come on, come on. The show's about to start. <laughs> My, my. Is that Cloud? Mm. Mm. Darling, I had no idea. <laughs> you? Well, you just sit tight until Andrea takes the stage. Look at his muscles. Aw, oh, he's blushing. <laughs> Welcome to the Honeybee Inn, Cloud. You seek my approval, do you? I understand. But those who crave my favor must first prove that they know how to move. Think you can follow my lead?
Well, you tried. <laughs> <Yeah>! <laughs> Honey, I may love. Yes. Yes, I will transform you into a vision of beauty. Now, without further ado, let us begin! for this. True beauty is an expression of the heart, a thing without shame, to which notions of gender don't apply. Don't ever be afraid, Cloud. That show today blew my mind! Look at me! I can dance too! How much did you drink Just tonight? Come over I can't here. help it. It was amazing! Drink. Now you that talk. was a show! Was it planned from the start? Probably not. Did you see their look of surprise? Huh. Cloud? Stage next time! It'll be my Yoo-hoo! Cloud! Hello? You are like Aerith the to Cloud! Flag come in! Blooms under the brilliant huh. Aerith to Cloud! Come in! Please don't. Such beauty is the spice of life. Wouldn't you agree? I'm gonna perform on stage next time. It'll be my favorite. That was the best performance I've seen hands down. Yeah. That'll be one to What a wild ride. Oh, I got to see it back. No regrets. What a wild ride! Wasn't it though? No regrets. Oh, that was the best performance I've seen. But one must be made such flowers from a false. Not a word. Not even one? No! But you're so pretty! You are like the beautiful flag that blooms under the brilliant. Hey, watch the way you walk. More drink. What do you say? It's uh, getting pretty late. Hey, little lady, are you lost or something? Tackling. Mm. There you go again. Stop looking at other girls. 
I only do it to get Can't have just food, one. The more you eat, the better they get. Fresh chocobo bean popcorn. Love to see her crack a smile. Am I dead? Did these beautiful angels come from me? It's absolutely legendary. My muscles ache just like that. Whoa, that is one hot chick. Wait for the next match. Huh? You're planning on fighting in that getup? <laughs> I don't know about that. Excuse me, miss, but are you sure you're in the right place? No way. Here you are. Letters from Andrea Rodea and Madam M. That ought to do the trick, right? You serious? Is there a problem? I hope you know what you're in for. Oh, we'll be fine. If you say so. Come on. The two of you here for the audition? Second floor, at the very end of the walk. And don't go poking your nose in where it doesn't belong. That one's Madam M's girl, ain't it? Man, she's hot. We've been waiting for you to show. Hey, hands to yourself. That Andrea's girl? I'd let her do go to your to room me. and wait. Quietly. Room's at the end. Keep walking. Feel so dizzy. Gas. Uh, uh? Come on. <clears throat> Damn it. Cloud. Hey, <laughs> 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 pretty ladies do. Feeling a little lightheaded, but we can't have that. What day we escort you to the parlor so you can make yourself more comfortable? Let's get this show on the road. Where are you taking us? Come on now. Lopsy daisy. Hey, you to look ten, asshole. The hell? You want to throw down the Corneo's girl? So if you leave a mark on him, you ain't getting off with a one. I know. Managed to wrangle some real lookers this time, though. Know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hey, can you hear me? Oh. Tifa? Yes? You okay? Mm-hmm. Good. Wait a minute. Cloud? Is that you? Oh my god, that makeup! And that dress! Nailed it, I know, thank you. Moving on. You good? Yeah, bit woozy, but I'll manage. <sighs> hey, Tifa, how you doing? Uh, okay. Oh, right. I'm Aerith, a friend of Cloud's. We were worried and thought we'd come help you out. Uh, thanks? Cut the chatter. We gotta leave. Huh? Right now. Uh, no, not until I've got what I came for. What? So... After we made it back to the slums, some guys came around asking all kinds of questions. 
So I did some digging. And found out they were Corneo's men. Right. They were interested in Avalanche. But I couldn't figure out why. So I thought I'd come and ask the man himself. Seriously? Thought if I could find a way in and get some one-on-one -on -one time, but then I realized I'd only be one of three candidates, and that if he didn't pick me, it would all be for nothing. Then your worries are over, aren't they? Because the other two candidates are right here, right? Uh, right. So yeah, if we're all in on it, then nothing can go wrong. Uh, I guess not. You? Me? Cloud? Makes no difference who gets chosen, does it? I don't know, Aerith. It feels wrong getting you involved in all this. Don't even bother trying to talk her out of it. Oh, Cloud gets me. Took you long enough. <sighs> so what happens now? I think they'll call for us when it's time. This room gives me the creeps. Well? Now ladies, listen up! I'm sure you're still feeling a bit woozy, but tonight's audition's about to begin! Head out the door to the left and up the stairs! Come on ladies, let's hustle! Alright guys, let's do this. <laughs> do you want to do this? Okay, my beautiful ladies, time to line up for the dawn. <sighs> hmm. Hmm? Wait, you look kind of familiar. We haven't met before, have we? Mm-mm. <sighs> uh, whatever. All right, y'all good to go? Then let's do this thing. Introducing Walmart's most eligible bachelor, the one and only Don Corneo. Ladies? Uh. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> Whichever one shall I pick? Mm. Oh. Shall I pick you? <laughs> or maybe you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah! I've got it! Today's bride-to-be is... Today's? And tomorrow's, or the day after's, if the dawn takes a shine to you. Pathetic. Huh? Hey, which one of you said that? Was it you? 
Ooh, you got a mouth on you. I'm going to enjoy breaking it in. Today's lucky lady is the big bone girl. Huh? Ooh, still playing hard to get? I can dig it. Oh, yeah. The leftovers are all yours. Yeah! yeah! Okay! <laughs> okay, ladies. Y'all coming with me. <sighs> Don't be shy, little kitten. Shimmy on over and give Daddy some sugar. No need to play coy. Nobody here but you and me. Oh, you're even cuter than I thought. Back off. Ooh! <laughs> this kitten's got claws! I love it! <laughs> what was that? Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Just a picture to preserve the moment. And to ensure you don't do anything inappropriate like say no. Asshole. Oh, praise me more! <laughs> Hey, yo, fellas! We got guests, and y'all huh? got first crack at entertaining them. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Courtesy of the ever-generous Don Corneo himself, never forget, the Don provides. Yeah. Corneo! <laughs> so, ladies, ready to... Get to it? Yeah. I guess I'm good to go whenever. How about you, Tifa? Hmm. Four guys between us. Okay. Let's not keep Cloud waiting. Right. Wait. I know you. The Coliseum! <laughs> what the hell? Get down! Don't <laughs> oh, you stupid! Wait! Good job, Aerith. It was nothing compared to you. <laughs> Andrea filled me in on the situation. I come bearing gifts, your gear. I'll do what I can to clean this up. Just finish the job. Okay, let's go rescue Cloud. Corneo's room, right? Better hurry. Better hurry. Man, I'd love to spend some quality time with girls like that. Bet they're going at it right now. Lucky bastard. What are you doing here? <laughs> hey, Tagging out! I got this. God damn it! Move it. <laughs> Don't stop! Tell me what you a bad boy I bastard. am! <laughs> yes, yes I am! Here I come, baby! <laughs> <laughs> hey, who the hell gave you permission to do that? One of you get in here and teach this bitch some manners! <sighs> Sorry, but your boys had to learn some manners too. What the? Cloud, your clothes! 
So you're a man, huh? What are you three up to? We'll ask the questions. Like, why'd you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Nah. Huh? Don't know what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Let's try again. Why did you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Spill the beans, or... I'll cut them off. All right, all right! I'll talk, I'll talk! <sighs> Uh, some guy with a gun for an arm. I was paid to find him. Paid by who? I can't tell you that. They'd hunt me down like a dog. Well, you better. Because if you don't, I'll rip them off. <laughs> it was the director of public security, Heidegger. It was Heidegger. Shinra. And what were they planning? Some things are better left unsaid, you know? See, I'm not so sure they are. Better keep talking. Or I'll smash them. <laughs> All right, you got me. I could never say no to a sexy girl. Since Avalanche blew up two reactors, Shinra's decided they ought to stamp them out, home base and all. And I mean, stamp out. By targeting the support pillar and blowing it up. The pillar? Did I stutter? The plate will come crushing down. It'll be Sector 6 all over again. I'm sure you've been there and seen the wreckage for yourself. So you know exactly what Sector 7's gonna look like. They wouldn't. Come on, guys. We gotta go. Before you do... No. Please, this won't take long. As everyone knows, villains only divulge their plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation? Hmm. Hmm? <laughs> oh. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry! Time's up! The answer lies... in the sewers. <laughs> Enjoy the sights and smells! <laughs>
Damn it, Reeks. Aerith. Uh, uh, Cloud. Uh. We have to get to Sector 7. Yeah. Uh. Uh. That bastard! No escape. Gotta be careful. Duty calls. You're up! 
I got this. Be careful. Tifa? Cloud. We have to get back to the slums right now. Yeah. I didn't want to drag Aerith into all this. She'll understand. How do you two know each other? I saved her. She saved me. Round and round it goes. 
end, that's all there is to it. Sure there isn't something else going on? Uh, uh, damn it. Thanks for coming to help! My turn. 
No need to panic.
Not looking good. That's it. There it goes. Do you think it lives down here, or...? It was probably Corneo's pet. And we were dinner. <laughs> hey, you don't believe that crazy story of his, do you? Shinra wouldn't sacrifice a whole sector just to take out Avalanche, would they? Destroying part of the city, killing all those people just to get at us? <laughs> I don't know. Is Corneo the kind of guy who'd make up shit just to screw with you? I wouldn't put it past him. But if he was telling the truth, hmm? and there's still a chance he was, isn't there, then we should go. And if it turns out he was lying, then so what? Right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, Tifa! I knew it. These tunnels are all connected. 